Okay, some more uh, definitions. Properties are characteristics of a system. Um, and we have some different types of properties, intensive, extensive, and specific. Intensive properties are not dependent on the mass or the size. So it doesn't matter if you have a little bit of it or a lot of it. Uh, it's temperature. You know, the temperature of this section of my system and the whole thing and this thing. The temperature uh, is an intensive property. The pressure, the density... Uh, any properties that are independent of mass or size are intensive properties, but extensive properties are dependent on on size, such as mass. You know, if I look at, if I have more of something, I'm going to have more mass, volume, uh, energy, momentum. Those aren't intensive, right? Those aren't intensive. Those are extensive. Those matter whether we have a little or we have a lot. So, in order to compare things, you know, if I want to compare my system and to compare to your system or a different system, and if yours is, if you have a lot more than I have, we might want to compare them. It might be helpful to take those extensive properties and divide them by mass. So it's almost like they become intensive properties. For example. Specific volume, lowercase v, we'll call this specific volume, is uppercase v, the volume, divided by the mass. Volume divided by mass. So we can compare specific volumes. It doesn't matter if I've got a little, I've, you, I've got a lot, we're dividing it by the mass. We can look at uh, specific work lowercase u, specific work, lowercase u is uppercase u divided by m, right? Work divided by mass. This is work. This is volume. Okay, let me have a little bit more room here. Uh, and another one is lowercase e, specific energy. Specific energy is uppercase E, total energy, divided by mass. This is total energy. So some of these are like total. <clears throat> we take the total divided by the mass to get specific. Now, pay careful attention throughout the semester are we talking about specific energy or total energy? You know, are we talking about specific work or total work? <clears throat> because the units are different, they are different. Um, and we, all our equations, we have to be consistent and homogeneous with all our equations. We can't take specific energy and add it to total heat energy, right? We can't take a specific and add it with a total. It have to be consistent. In general... <clears throat> So let's say generally, lowercase variables are specific, and uppercase are total or are extensive properties. Uppercase V is total volume, uppercase U, total work, uppercase E, total energy. Very important to pay attention. What are you given? What are you asked to find? What are the units for all of these? And be consistent um, in all of our problems.